Hello. Welcome to the training video, how to create a Windows 10 recovery checkpoint, how to delete it, and how you can restore the operating system from this checkpoint if you encounter problems due to viruses, software or application crashes, or you accidentally made changes to your Windows. Let's get started. Before doing anything, I recommend updating the operating system. I click the start button. Settings. Updates and security. Check for updates. Now create a system restore checkpoint. I click on the start button with the right mouse button. System. System information. System protection. If you have several disks, you need to mark drive C, where Windows is located and click. Configure. If your system protection is disabled, turn it on. Here you need to specify how much disk space to allocate for the system protection function. I put the engine at 5 GB. And click, to apply. OK. We have enabled system protection. Now create a recovery point. Click, create. Here we write the name for this point. And click, create. And now our computer is protected from all sorts of problems. You can configure the system so that it constantly and automatically creates new recovery points, deleting the old ones to free up disk space. I will not do this and I recommend setting the restore point myself before each installation of a new program or application on the computer. And if the installation was successful, and the new application works without problems, delete the old point, and again install a new restore point. Next I will show how to restore the system using the restore point. There are several recovery methods. If the system starts, I recommend using this method. Press and hold the shift key on your keyboard, then restart your computer. If your computer cannot boot the system due to any problem, then after turning on the device, the recovery program starts automatically, where you can activate the point created earlier in the same way. The computer rebooted and enters the system restore program. Press here. Now here. Press system restore. And the computer rebooted. Here you need to write the password for your Microsoft account and continue the recovery. Here you can read how recovery occurs, I click, next. In the next window you need to mark the recovery point, and click, next. In this window you can read the instructions, I click, finish. There is a warning in this tab that during recovery you cannot turn off the computer, and you need to wait until the system is fully restored. I click, yes, and the system recovery has begun. Recovery is over, and you need to restart your computer. Here we see a message that the system recovery happily happened, and in conclusion, I will show you how to delete an old restore point. I click on the start button with the right mouse button, system, system info, system protection. I mark the disk with the operating system and click, configure. I click here, delete. The system prompts you to read and confirm the removal. I click, continue. All control points are deleted, this video tutorial ends, and I say goodbye to you. Thank you very much for your attention to my video. Good luck.